Hey guys, go back to another Clash Royale video, and today we'll be taking a look at an updated list of the top five best decks in Clash Royale right now, in my opinion. It's been about a month and a half since my last video in this series, and with the recent global tournament coming up very, very soon, I wanted you all to have the absolute best decks in the game for the global tournament or for just pushing trophies on ladder. The first deck you can already see right here is a 3.1 elixir. Double barrel cycle deck. You have skeleton barrel and the golden barrel in there. Inferno tower for defense, princess, and the dark elephant for range support and bait. Then you have this garment for high DPS and for bait action as well. And the knight is one of the strongest tanks in the game. Overall, very effective strategy. Deck two over here is going to be a goblin giant sparky mini pack, a rage deck. Very, very devastating if your opponent is caught off guard, especially with that rage spell making everything attack so much faster. Deck three over here is going to be a golem god. Goblin Cage Lightning Deck. You have the Goblin Cage in there to soak things like wall breakers or to pull enemy tanks. And then you have the bonus of having that Goblin Brawl spawn on afterwards to support your Golem on the counter push. Deck 4 over here is going to be a Royal Recruit Rural Hug Split Lane Pressure Deck. It's been in the meta for a very, very long time now and is currently, in my opinion, one of the top decks in the entire game. Then finally over here, we have ourselves the Fast Cycle 2.9 Elixir Wall Breaker Knight Monitor cycle deck. You have Magic Archer in there as a backup with condition. NATO for control. Bomb Tower for a defense. Overall, just an absolutely disgusting fast cycle strategy in Clash Royale. But I would say it is the highest skill cap required deck on this list, so it does take a bit of practice to get the hang of this particular strategy. But those are the five decks we're taking a look at today, guys. We're going to go ahead and do one lap battle with each of these decks, starting out with the double barrel deck first. But first, guys and girls, if you want to support me in the channel, go ahead, throw in credit code Shane into your shop before buying things like Pass Royales or special offers or gems. It is a fantastic fantastic way to support the channel and honestly helps a lot more than you may think so thank you if you are rocking code chain in your shop all right guys and girls here we go jumping in with the double barrel fast cycle strategy absolutely disgusting deck in clash royale but honestly a ton of fun to play as well get a little bit of tower damage on there with that goblin barrel let me go uh night sauce for these skeleton barrels here and then probably just end up logging this back here because the princess will retarget to the skeleton dragons and I'm gonna go Skeleton Barrel as well, keep the pressure high, keep it going. He probably has a clone deck in there. He probably has a clone deck. By the way, guys, emo attorneys, if you're interested, uh, stuff. So we're gonna go, oh, no, oh, yes. Yes, let's go, boys. <gasps> he just arrows my princess. Yikes, yikes, yikes. So, um, all right, Goblin Stabbing. Get some good damage done there. It's 100% clone deck, though. Which could be nasty because we don't have like NATO or poison. So Princess has to stay alive. Probably Golem. Probably, probably the Golem clonage is my guess. We got Dark Goblin right here. Get some stuff done to that tower. Bada boom, bada bing, bada boom. Four shots. All right, so we're gonna go Infernal Dragon right here for this. Um, Princess over on the left hand side here. She needs to snipe the the swarmage, right? Oh, nice play, my friend. Wait for it. Let's do one of these, boys. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Yes. I'm a hundred percent okay with that. This needs to stop now. Put the shoot the skeleton drags, please. Thank you, girl. I appreciate your assistance, there, drags. So I'm gonna go back here with that. He's probably gonna go scar me for it, to be honest, though. Arrows in time? Oh, that's poor dude. Doesn't go arrows in time. Now he's sad panda. Boom. All right, so we got princess left lane, princess right lane. Just getting everything done here. And we're gonna go a smelting barrel again. Sure. What you got for, oh, a skeleton dragon, okay. And an arrows, okay. I wonder if he realizes he needs that arrows for the defense, or for the offense, sorry. I wonder, does he realize? We're gonna go all the way on the front here and then we're gonna pre-log for a Skarmy. Oh, the Skarmy got destroyed. It didn't even exist. The Skarmy didn't even exist for a mere moment. Wow. Poor dude. Okay. 
We could almost even three crown this guy. I suppose. Let's do one of these. Does that pull it? No, that does not pull it, Shane. Yeah, nub sauce. That didn't pull it, but we still win. Irregardless. One. That was close. That was close. I went to go night there, and then I went dark off, and then the dark off and hovered and didn't go down. But, uh, good game. All right, Mr. Emotional. We have the Sparky Golden Giant Mini Pekka deck over here. And it's bound to be spicy. The spice factor is bound to be insane. Sir? Oh, no, don't be... Ugh. Please don't be Expo, bro. Out of all the decks you could possibly have, Emotional. Sir? Oh, it's maybe not Expo. If it's Expo, we dead, son. Graveyard. It's one of these boys. Let's go for it. Goblin Giant helped clean up quite nicely, TBH. Got this down. And he's gonna go scar me here. Just some archers, okay. I was gonna rage that, but you know what? Let's just let's just chill instead. E Dragon right here, please, for the uh that. I'll go some DP action here for this. What did he have tanking for his graveyard last time? I forget. Oh night, that's right, that's right. Hey, sure. It's emotional. Don't snowball me, sir. That's no kind. That's no kind at all, my friend. Alright, so we're gonna get some Sparkinator action once again, left lane. Uh this time I'm gonna go s the rage spell. Is the plan. He might go bar barrel graveyard here though, eh? I think Ops Lane Pressure is the answer. He probably has Infernal Tower in there too, eh? Or something. What is it you say? I do not know. Why do I talk like this, you ask? I also do not know. Should I stop, you say? The answer is still definitely no. Yes, go! <laughs> the, 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 the voice crack right there was insane, bro! Go, Goblin Giant! <laughs> wow, that was embarrassing. 31 years old and I'm still cracking the voices. Wow. That's uh, unfortunate. Does is unfortunate? Uh, yes. Okay, sir. Wait for it. Boom. Let's go, boys. Yes. Let's get it done today, boys. Fireball here? No. Just a snowballs, eh? All right, cool. So, I would dare say, Mr. Emotional is in need of rescue right now. Would y'all not say that? I <laughs> oh, I'm a big old nub. Yeah, I me right here. Big old nub sauce. I'm gonna get here for this. Yo, Sparky, shoot! Thank you, girl. Well, good game. Well played. Very interesting kind of like graveyard deck. But yeah, good game, sir. Well played. Try again next time, buddy. Try again next time. Okay, Bao. Mr. Bao. Is it Bao or is it Bale? We're gonna just not say it so that way we don't say the wrong thing. But uh, yeah, good luck to- Oh no! A baby D. Potentially a graveyard E. Man, I should, I should go into rap music, right? Busting these rhymes out. Oh no! That's a golem! Arrgh. I kind of wish I had my Goblin Umbrella right now for this Golem defense. That kind of shocks, eh? That kind of shocks, does it not? Yes, it does, Shane. Yes, it does indeed. Yes, it does, Shane. Yes, it do. Hola. Wait for it. Okay. I mean... That's that. It's not good, but it, it is that, right? Wow, that sucked. I don't like that in the slightest, guys. Barbarian gets two shots, right? Noise. 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 No. Absolute perfection. Oh, no. A golem again. Oh, no. It's a bit too close up with my goblin cage right there, I would say. Um, I kind of want to go a Night Witch in this biz. Uh, or actually, right here in this biz. 
He probably has lightning spell though, eh? Which is gonna suck. Baby D here. Yeah. But that's okay. Come on, brawler. <laughs> yes. Go, brawler, go. I said, uh, go, brawler, go. Yes, one smack a room, brawler, please. Barbarian, one shot. Please, sir. Thank you, sir. I appreciate your assistance, sir. Sorry, I'll stop being annoying now. He's gonna go golem at the bridge here. It's gonna be like, oh, do I gotta defend this and stuff? Like, how do I defend this and stuff? Like, ooh, this is not gonna be fun, dudes. Ooh, do, 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 do. Let's go, boys. Let's do one of these. Okay. Can we survive here, boys? Is the question here. Let's go. Hyper aggressive lightning spell by Mr. Bale. Mr. Bale, we shouldn't. Let's do one of these. One of these here, boys. Ugh. That's an aggressive goal that we didn't need. We didn't need that, boys. We didn't need that, boys. Or did we? Ew, I missed that. Well, that sucks. Talk about overcommittal sauce. Wow, that sucks. Yeah. Talk about overcommitting there, son. Do one of these? Let's go. Yeah. <sighs> go, brother, one smack a real, please, sir. You had one job, brother. Can we lightning spell for the win? I think we can, boys. Yes, bail. Good game. That was stressful, but we made it work, sir. Good game. Yo, Luchinator. Is that what I said? Is that what it is? I, I did say that. But the question, rather, is that what his name is? And that's the new the new Terminator sequel coming to you. The Luchinator. Come to th theaters near you. So, Zappy is in the right lane. Zappy is in the left lane. Getting some work done, hopefully. Oh, a Ram Rider. That's a Prince, Shane. That's a Prince, you know. It sounds the same, right? They both have that little sound effect, right? No, they don't. They sound very dissimilar, Shang Yun Dub. Alright, so recruits get some recruiting stuff done to that. Gonna go- Oh no! Man, the mini Pekka's and the- What a disgusting deck, bro. Yo, seriously, Clash Roy? Seriously? He's got three spells, bro? You don't think two is enough, Luchinator? Wow, man. Fireball arrows and the Zat spell. And then Mini Pekka and the Prince. Talk about an unfortunate circumstance right there when we're rocking a Fireball Bait deck. Bro. Broski. Luchinator. Oh no, Graveyard here, left lane. It should be okay here though, right, for this? Girl, this down here. Maybe a bit overly aggressive with that graveyard defense, I would say. <laughs> look at the one little zap in the right lane that just destroys. He's just like, look at me, I can do stuff. Eh, hey, okay. Let's do one of these boys. Get. Why did I fireball that for? I got nothing accomplished. Good job, Shane. You nub. So, it's a mini Pekka Prince Graveyard Giant triple spell deck. Urgh, that's not fun, man. Oh no, another Prince coming down here. Goblin Cage here, please, sir. Hmm? Recruit here, please, sir. This is a bit of overcommittal by him here, sir. 
because the E Spirit just destroys all of the graveyard here, sir. And then we got a brawler popping out of this business. Popping out of this business. Do one of these boys? Fireball the right tower right here, right? Furry ball coming down right here. Pew! Yep. But he missed the piggies, sir! Luchinator! I think you need a software update, my friend. Because you missed your aim. Luch! Sir! Are you alright, my friend? This is the T500, not T1000. This is the T500. <laughs> uh, sir, good game, well played. I mean, yeah, good game. Yo, Lord RH. RH, sir? Oh, I see you got some wall breakers too, my friend. If I log this back here, is that enough? Oh, he's got NATO in there. Maybe a mirror matchup. Potentially a... Ah, no, he's got that. Which typically does not be used in one of these decks. Okay. So maybe it's the cannon card for... Oh, I don't know what it is anymore. It's something with... Okay. Spears here. That's a lot more damage than I would have hoped for. I was kind of thinking the uh, bomb tower would actually destroy all of those wall breakers, but it missed the second bomb, which is lame. Knight here for this? Yes. Sir? My friend, Lord RH. Sir, what you got here, my friend? What's back here? One of these? He's gonna go Valkyrie in the back. Just Melatans? Maybe a Valkyrie here, yes. Thank you. King tower activation. I mean, I can respect that. That is a respectable play, is it not? Magic Archer here to his tower as well. What you got for that, sir? I mean, that's some respectable tower damage, is there, eh? One of these boys? <laughs> Uh, minor overcommittal. Yeah. Man, I play these decks way too overly aggressive. I don't even know why, man. I just do. It's just like my thing. I think overcommitting is my like. If there's, if, if anyone had one thing, one signature move in this game, mine would be overcommitting. 100%. Let's go. All right. Well, that happened. Do so one of these, one of these? Okay, sir. Let's go, boys. Do this, boys. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yes, let's go. Okay. So he poisoned my miner, I think. I think that's the poison of my miner right there, guys. I'm pretty sure. That's a poison on that for sure. Okay, what do you got now? Yes, let's go. One of these, let's go. This is how we win right here, boys. This is how we win. Yes, Magic Archer locks on. <laughs> oh, Lord RH. So that was a close battle. He had a Valkyrie, which I don't know if it gives him an edge or not. I don't think it does. But the fact that he had poison, I think, made him have a disadvantage because it's too slow for this matchup. Anyways, Lord RH, good game. Anyways, guys and girls, that is the end of the video. Here are the five decks one more time. First, we had the Double Barrel Fast Cycle. Second, we had the Sparky Goblin Giant deck. Third was the Golem Goblin Cage Ice Wizard. Fourth was the Royal Recruit Split Lane Pressure deck. And fifth and finally was the Super Fast Cycle Ultimate Spam deck with Wall Breakers and the Magic Archer. Give them a try. Let me know how they go for you. But it is the end of the video. Thank you for watching. We shall see you in the next one.